What's up rock stars? Welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be very nostalgic because we are going to be doing the how I wore my makeup in high school challenge or tag or whatever this is. Um, and for me in high school I wore makeup my like freshman and sophomore year like I'm gonna do it today and then my junior and senior year I did get a little bit better I definitely definitely did not know what concealer was and I never wore um, liquid foundation like my junior and senior year I wore um, bare minerals the original loose foundation now I am going to be cheating a little bit because I'm going to be using the Urban Decay Electric Palette. When I was in high school, Rimmel had these little eyeshadows. It was like a three different color like shadow, but it was a little bit bigger than a single shadow. It was kind of like the size of a blush compact, and they don't make them anymore. I went to Ulta, I went to Target, I went to Walmart, I went to Walgreens, I went to CVS. They don't make them anymore. They don't exist, which is really, really, really sad. Um, so I'm going to use the electric palette because it's the closest thing to what I actually used. So without further ado, let's see how I did my makeup in high school. I'm going to start off by using this guy. This is the Neutrogena Skin Clearing Blemish Concealer. And this is in the shade Light because I'm pale AF. And what I would do is twist it up. until product comes out there we go and I would put this all over my blemishes which I don't have very many of today which is amazing I'm really impressed with that so we're not gonna need too much of this but that's okay and then for foundation, I'm going to be using the Neutrogena Skin Clearing Oil-Free Makeup. This is in the shade number 30 Buff. I'm pretty sure this does not match me at all. Um, I would go back and forth between this one and the cream compact version of this that they no longer make, which is kind of a bummer because I liked that one better. But we're going to take a handy makeup wedge, shake this guy up, and I never blended out my concealer. When I put it on, I just left it there and then just started putting this on my face. This is definitely a good foundation if you are starting in makeup and have acne problems because it does have salicylic acid. I think it's salicylic acid. Yeah, salicylic ac acid acne treatment infused in it, which is really nice and that's why I used it because I had acne like most high school aged girls and boys. Now, even though I'm oily and I was oily in high school, um, I never ever set my face with powder or anything and I never wore any sort of primer. Like primer did not, did not exist. Now when I was in high school I did have like a teeny tiny little brush set from Ulta. It had like five brushes in it and I tried to find a similar set at Ulta and they did not have them. So I am going to just be using my regular brushes. Um, but just a little side note. So what I would do is I would take one of the three colors 
and I would put it all over my lid. Just like that. Then I would take the same brush because I only had five and I would go in with another one of the colors and I would put it right in the crease. And I didn't blend, didn't know what blending was, I just kind of put them on. And then I would take the brush that was more like an eyeliner brush and I would put that in another color and I would line my eyes like this. Now just keep in mind this was not as intense as it looks right now because the shadows I used were not nearly as pigmented and high quality as the electric palette and I'd also put this on the bottom and then I would go in with a black eyeliner the one that I used was from NYC and it was retractable they don't make it anymore I checked so I'm just gonna use my NYX Trajoli um, retractable black liner and what I did with this was I lined my upper lash line with this which completely covers up most of the eyeliner that we did, the eyeliner that we did with the eyeshadow. And then I would do my lower waterline. And then I would put on mascara. Now me, in high school, I never used the same mascara twice. I purchased pretty much every single drugstore mascara except for the Maybelline Great Lash, the, the one that's in the pink and green bottle. I never, ever, to this day, have ever, ever tried that. Never. I don't know why. It didn't appeal to me. I don't know. But for today, I'm going to be using the Rimmel Lash, Ex Lash Accelerator. And I did not give two Fs if it ended up all over my eyelid, just like it's doing right now. Okay, then the very last thing I would do after putting on my mascara is I would put on a boatload of this um, CoverGirl True Blend Minerals loose bronzer. I already put some on my face because I thought I was recording and I wasn't. So we're just gonna add some more just so you could get the effect. Um, I would tap it on like so. Literally. Everywhere. And then I would take a blush brush and just kind of blend it all in. So now I look like a glowing bronze goddess. And that was it. I never wore anything on my lips except for maybe some chapstick. I had a bunch of little lip glossy things like this that I would maybe wear every once in a while, but not enough to really even show in the video. This is why I never got dates. Like. Why didn't you guys tell me? <laughs> I did debate doing a like dance version of this because I was a competitive dancer um, from the time I was like, I think seven was when I started competing until I graduated from high school. Um, but that was a lot more like, what you should do and how you should do your makeup. So it's not as fun, but I'll definitely insert some pictures um, 
from my dance days and the makeup that I had on then. So that is it for me for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to click on the link down below to stay up to date on what's going on in my beauty corner of the world or the subscribe button at the end of this video and I will see you in my next one. I love you so much. Thanks for watching. What's up rock stars? Welcome back to my channel. Yes, I know. Same makeup, same hair, same top. 